And friends said goodbye today to a Navy SEAL from Stanford who was killed in Afghanistan. Funeral services were held for Chief Petty Officer Brian Bill. He was one of 30 Americans who died when the Taliban forces shot down his helicopter. News 8's Allie Reid has our report. 31-year-old Brian Bill was a Stanford native, but today it was clear that his life and his death touched many more people outside of the Stanford community. Hundreds of friends, fellow military men and women, and perfect strangers showed up today at Stanford Cecilia Parish for the Navy SEAL's funeral. My wife and I didn't know him personally, but uh, we respect what he did, and we were here for him and for his family and, and for all who serve like him. Members of the Patriot Guard riders and other folks from across the state and country stood in silence waving the American flag as the funeral procession pulled up to the church. We're just hoping that it, it has a little bit of an impact and, and makes the family and friends feel like their, you know, people are, do, are supporting them and, and are here. Those who were inside the church for the service say it was a beautiful tribute to the hometown hero. Other people who had served with him and uh, talked about his valor and, and uh, all of the medals that he'd received and, and uh, just the kind of person he was. He had a tremendous heart. These young men give everything for us and uh, the least we can do is respect that and be here for them and for their families. The family of Brian Bill released this statement. It reads, in part, today we mourn the loss of our son, brother, friend, and hero. We also celebrate Brian's life and honor his courage and his service to our country. It goes on to say, Brian meant the world to us, and there will always be an emptiness in our hearts and our souls. Reporting on the scene in Stanford, Allie Reed, News 8.